Welcome back everyone to the next installment of No More Heroes 3. We have a boss to fight. There we go, I was waiting for that. We've prepared a special entrance. Please proceed to Perfect World. Alright. I really do appreciate that I could teleport without even being on the bike. I could just go. So easy. Yep. All right. Where's the fight? Maybe I should have stayed on the bike. Let's do this. Perfect. Oh. For some reason it's a long hallway this time. And what is this? I could just leave if I want to? Oh, I thought it would give me an option. But yeah, I can just leave if I want to. Alright. Weird that they're making me run all this way for it, but okay. I've already done Chef's Choice. When you die, you can replenish your health, though. That's pretty nice. And enemies more easily stunned. That's also very nice. But I'll go with Tokujo Nigiri. Chef Bogzaburo's Pace de Resistance. Served a la carte, loaded with only the best fish. When you die, you can replenish your health. Yay. And this is the save. I shouldn't really need to do this, but why not? All right, let's get to it. With those deadly premonition petals. Oh. Here we go! Awesome holiday! In the sky! <laughs> really? Wow, not cool. Uh, what? I'm getting my kill stolen twice? Oh, 
Ooh. That's a silver case nod. That's pretty amazing. I like that the fans are cheering this. This is great. This is pretty amazing. Some environment, this is great. I have invincible mode activated. Yikes. This stuff doesn't mess around. do stuff when I use my death glove or is it just a coincidence? Going for the perfect dodge, didn't work. Well, we're on phase three now. Fire and lasers, I see. Yep. Wombo combo. This is pretty nuts. I gotta learn the jump. Raspberry, 
What? I thought it was because I got the throw, but no, the camera is just going crazy. This is disorienting. This is like God of War Ascension. Where it's so zoomed out, it's hard to see what's going on. But it sure does look cool. Look at all those lasers! Maybe it's better that they're showing me this crazy angle after all. I lost my kick. However... Power bomb again. Wow. No, he went for it. This time. That's a bad girl kill, even though bad girl lived. And by the way, that whole opening rap about how it's been 10 years, remember me? She was the the schoolgirl in No More Heroes 2, who's a super fan and wants to fight you. So now she's back and we freaking annihilated her. <laughs> Kimmy's second single, amazing. Congratulations. You've been recognized as number seven in the galactic rankings. And just look at this kid. I guess she just could not grow up after all. This is the last time I kill a woman. Well, how kind of you. Don't ever hit a girl. My grandma used to tell me that. Uh-huh. What are you, a good Samaritan now? How far do you think that kind of posing will get you? Kimmy wasn't supposed to be a ranked assassin, was she? I'm only after those fucking alien assholes. I never signed up for this. The strong survive. That is how the world of killing works. You have not forgotten, have you? Did you think you were going to become friends and team up to defeat the big, mean aliens? This is not a superhero movie. It is not that simple. Why don't you ask your katana there just how much blood it has sucked so far? <laughs> they just drive onto the stage. It is still too early. Stay at the ready, though. Failed to talk to her again. Yeah, we fought five women, I think, in No More Heroes 1, and we killed three of them? No More Heroes 2. Margaret and Alice. Oof, I'm kind of flaking on how many uh, more women there were as bosses. There was Kimmy herself, but we definitely didn't kill her, clearly. But, I mean, we've done our fair share. It's not like we killed one and we're like, oh, I don't know. Like, we've been doing it the whole time. Oh, wait, there was that one Metal Gear Solid woman? Who had, like, the acid moves? So, we fought and killed a bunch. Didn't kill them all, but... Travis has a pretty consistent history here. It's just so weird to me that we had two alien bosses... ...just, uh, pulled out from under us. How many aliens are we actually gonna fight in this game? I mean, I guess we got closure with Kimmy out of nowhere. She was Kimmy Howell. Now she's Kimmy Power. Maybe that's just her stage name or something? Also, they do keep calling this guy Prince, but it it still didn't really click. They're like, oh, I'll tell the king. Like, yeah, I guess he does have a parent. 
who might be even crazier. The energy source of the future is cow manure. That is extremely cyborg ninja. Here it comes. Where's Damon? He said he would be out on his monthly glamping trip today. Oh, that guy is such a hassle. What's up with Velvet Chair Girl? She called in saying she could not make it due to an appointment at the nail salon. I see. So she couldn't make it, huh? Was it really such an important appointment? It is for her nails, so... Okay, I'll let this one slide. Seriously, women are the biggest hassle of them all! Both humans and aliens are a hassle. You got something you want to say? No, my apologies for... Huh. I do like how she's like, well, it is for her nails. Ugh, I'll let it slide. <laughs> Hooray, here we go. I'm assuming we are going to be fighting that alien on the nail appointment. She's the one who had the little octopus thing blow up the town in the opening animated trailer. Dead cannon. Nope, I don't think so. You're just hella wrong. You're hella wrong. You have no idea how much Mike loves the original material. That's bullshit. Mike never read the original. The script is what's most important. The script is what the entire art form is based on. You can't make a movie without knowing the material. I mean, don't underestimate Mike's love for the originals. So, uh, so any old hardcore maniac can make a movie then. All you need to do is love the originals, right? What about terraformers then, huh? Wow. Terraformers is. Terraformers is. You want to watch it again? Terraformers? Let's do it! By the way, I didn't really notice until uh, now, but Travis is wearing whatever t shirt you have in those TV scenes. It's all heavily pixelated, but you can see it. Although we got more of the kittens hanging around now. A t shirt. Finishing point, even though, you know, it's the wrong shirt, but. Should have been Kimmy Power. But you know what? Vanishing point was still cool. Alright. Let's get out of here. Let's get our new email, which we may already have, but let's get the indication that we have mail. I'm excited to do more map exploration. You've got mail. Two. Number six. Thirty-five thousand. Boo. Oceans 51. <laughs> That's great. You should watch Oceans 51. You're killing me with these spam messages. Alright, so... Not really seeing anything new here. Or there. Oh, but I can go here now and continue my adventure. Call of Battle. All right, where's the interchange? Okay, it's actually right here. This is good. Although, you know what I will do first? Real quick. I'll make a couple of bucks by turning in my trading cards. Shuriyabu, Kuryonagi. Alright, so let's turn this stuff in. Cool. And I can afford the ATM fee, just like that. Of course, I could always spend more money on making death chips. 
It's not like I'm guaranteed to maintain my 35,000, but still, I already have the entry fee. All I need to do is do the designated matches. So that's a good start. There we go. Won't even nitro. Freaking yikes. Here's a question. Do I need to be on the bike? Ugh. Yes, I do. Uh. There we go. There, I did it. Okay, Call of Battle. I'm excited. You know, I gotta say, that Kimmy Power fight kind of reminded me of Harvey Moiskiewicz Bolodarsky in that it was just on stage. And there's a, a, an adoring audience as well. Find the designated match, yes, of course, but... What is up with this place? Well, we have ourselves a t-shirt, alien. I hear kittens. And I hear kittens. Well, alien first. Five types of figures. I haven't collected one type of figure. See? I haven't gotten a damn thing. Now this guy called me a loser in front of everybody. Anyway, where's the, the kitten? It's hard to see. The visuals in this place are rough. Oh, good. More kitties in the apartment, please. Hell yes! All right. Now, I guess I might as well. Well, now let's do the designated fight. Or I could go the wrong way and go toward another designated match. Am I allowed to? walk into these areas? I totally am. Sort of. This place is rough. Oh! I, I didn't even see that for what it was. I was used to like a white looking scorpion. Well, that sucks. I'm gonna have to find something to teleport to. Well, I found my designated match anyway. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to re-find that scorpion. Alright, let's go into whatever this is. Here it goes. See ya. Devastation. Too bad I couldn't hit the guy next to me because I was doing a vertical slash. Wouldn't that have been nice? However, ah, nuts. Oh, I'm getting a little bit better at this. Good, I'm tired of dealing with that guy. I don't like these guys, they block too much. Good. Oh, 
Okay. I didn't get the finishing strike, so I guess my little projectile stuff from the sky got him. That's nice rank, alright. 4,000 coins, and I got coconut. Do you think I could find the scorpion again? I'm not very confident about it, but I'll check. And this time I need two blue designated matches, rather than two reds and one blue. Two blue and one red. I wonder if it's going to come to a point where I need three blue, or if there's going to be a new color introduced. Oh, there's the scorpion. Okay. Just got to sneak up on it. God, I love that. Black and cool. Okay. That went better than I thought. Now... Okay, I'm right near a save. Can I go in there, do you think? I want to know if I could go in these buildings. Wouldn't that be interesting? But it's looking like that's not going to be an option. And I don't think the bike would be very happy traveling through this area either. Apparently I'm right on the area. Hmm. Well, there is a path going through here. This is something. I'm getting farther from where I had intended to go, but whoops, guess what? I found the designated fight. Is there anything else here? Doesn't really seem to be. May as well clear this yellow circle out. Bring it on! Oh, yikes. Again with the guy who likes to block. I'm not a fan. Aha, fool. Rats, I got hit by that projectile thing. Aha, refill. He's not dead, but... Oh, he is. Bam, get out of here. Ah, I didn't go through the shield with that. Too bad. Wouldn't that have been nice? Fool. Look at that stun. This is very satisfying. And we got another one. No attack based little upgrades though. Whaley guy. Oh, I'm almost dead, I'm realizing. How did that happen? I got hit by more shields than I thought, huh? Can I get an invincible? Oh, this is good. This will help. This is very convenient. Good, that's probably my biggest threat, although I can easily screw up with the other guys. Because these guys can shoot. See, that could have gotten me, just like that. That's going to take me a long way. Got 
got him. That was actually close. Once again, I get too caught up in just mashing the attack button, but it worked. This time. B rank, which is probably more than I deserve. Oh, oh, more visual novel. Seedling. With Damon. Highway sidewalk again. Where is he? Where are you, huh? Across the road. Oh. I can't really see you. Is that so? But you're becoming able to see me more than before, yes? I heard I can ask for anything I want. Of course! As long as you pay the appropriate price. Even murder? I don't dabble in such vulgarity. However, I am able to perform actions that would result in death. Is there really a difference? Of course there's a difference. Can you kill anyone? If that's what you wish. The problem lies in why exactly you want the person in question dead. Why? Do you need a reason? Yes. That's part of the price you must pay. Think about that first. The money comes after that. The reason I want them dead is... I can't hear you. You're still not fully prepared. Let's speak again later. Fascinating. To be continued. Interesting. And of course I still have my own adventure to discover. So, about that save point. Where in the world? I think that was it down there. Unfortunately, it's in an inconvenient location. I can't even go over that. Come on now. Also, I guess I'll knock this out. I'm getting too distracted, but I am knocking things off of the map, so who can complain? Don't let me down, dude. Party time. Yay, 1.5 times attack. I still want to see what happens if I get Fu as my respawn thing. Time, okay? There's only one of him on the wheel. I'm assuming it's good. If you get little Fu, you know, Jimmy, man, I love you, then you get nothing. You just restart the fight. Which isn't even that bad. It's just like a regular retry, which is what you'd probably expect anyway. Wow. Didn't even mean to dodge that well, but who could complain? Look at this! 1.5 times attack and I'm playing better? Got him. I know I got hit by the ring, but worth it. Because you're done. Ah. Oh, dodged one, got tagged by another. You just healed my glove, but... Again, this guy hits harder than I give him credit for. There it is. That's a lot of damage. I tried dodging, didn't quite work. I have one little pixel left, so let's make it count. 
Got him. <laughs> Damn, not my finest performance, but that was a pretty sweet finish. B rank, I'll take what I can get. By the way, I didn't notice. Like, I know the... I got mail. I knew the picture was washed out, but did you notice just the dimensions of the screen? They're a little bit curved around the corners. It's like we're watching this whole thing through a CRT. That's super clever. I'll check the mail. You can do the fight. 35,000 bucks. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. Now, how do I get over there? Again, probably should be taking my bike, but whatever, it's fine. You could see the thing anyway. We got it. Also, this is this building I could just go in? This must be the adventure. Sushi? And I'll back off for now. There, I've activated it. You found out what it is. Now, let's save the day for the WC. Hooray, everybody! Good for me. Okay. Anyway, about that adventure. Which is what I assume this is. Oh no, this was a card. Okay. General death. Cool. So where's my adventure? Oh, it was way over elsewhere. Alright, here's another Coast Guard mission. T-shirt, I believe we've already discovered. Yeah, let's do a Coast Guard mission. And there are three designated fights, and there are a bunch of question marks. This whole place... That's gotta be where the boss fight is. Am I even allowed to take the bike through here? I might have to walk this. This looks like No More Heroes 1, where I went through all those landmines and fought that uh, one girl with a metal leg. Is there anything new here? Because I could just do this. Or do you just say the same thing? Yeah, I'm assuming I'm just gonna go into the level regular. Of course it's a gold. Come on now. I took down a giant, giant alligator. New level. I will try the next one. Nope. This one. Level two. Hopefully it's not more time. Two minutes. But if it's harder, I'm a little nervous. They, they certainly spawn in faster. And is it me or are they moving faster? They are running, my god. This is gonna be scary. Normally I just go left to right, see what I hit first, but I absolutely have to go for the closer guys first. They are way too fast. I might actually die. Jesus. So some run and some walk. But even so, th this is pressure. A red one. Could we not? This is crazy. 
And they're not giving me a break either. I don't know why the red ones walk sideways. Do they have like a special attack? This is making me very nervous. You think I couldn't see those? Relentless. I swear to God, that big guy better not be running. Th this is brutal. You can't be. I, I, I can't. Oh my God. That was nuts. Jeez. No mercy. That was tough. First try, but damn. There better not be a level 3. That was crazy. You're damn right, 4,500. Damn. Okay, anyway. We have more designated missions. Uh, I guess I'll do this one first, just because it's in all this junk. Can I? Damn, no cheating. Hopefully I could just make it there. Ooh, I don't know about this. And what's up with the trench? If it leads up and through, that'd be great. I'd hate to have to have to walk all the way out. I do see something, though. Oh, it's a scorpion. Well, you know what? It's a good thing I came here after all. Da -da -da -da. Super hard. Okay. Can't complain. And we do have this building. Is it anything? Nope. Well, you know what? Maybe I should just stay out here if this is beach and I can't take my bike. This is frustrating, but it'll ultimately prove to be worth it. See? There's a designated match right now. And there's another scorpion, it seems. I'm gonna get the scorpion first, because otherwise I'll forget. Plus, if I screw it up, then I could always enter the designated match. Oh, it's gonna suck walking back, though. Let's just not aggravate this thing. Good enough. It smells all fruity. Alright. Designated match time. Okay, we're going into space. Been a while. That's so cool. So, new enemy or not? Whoa. Let's go. Whoa. Could we not? The multi-faced horror eats all. Look at those beautiful chompers. This alien spits corrosive biobombs on a weird worm-like creature from his enormous mouth. This is one truly terrifying monster. Destroy him. The world is at stake. His weak spot's inside his mouth. Try to keep moving around him. Don't stop in one place for too long. It's cool. I fought a boss like this in an old death drive shoot him up. It was a side scroller, but still. All right, one more time. Oh no. It's one and a half times power or nothing. Damn you, foo. Alright, so I really gotta focus on this guy's mouth when it's open. Freaking yikes.
Yeah, he doesn't keep his mouth open for long enough is the problem. Wrong mouth, buddy. Open one that's more relevant to my interests. Ah, damn. See, he closes his mouth. There we go. There we go. That's something. And the music's great. mess around. I'm just hanging around one mouth, but it looks like he opens just the wrong one exclusively. I might need to actually boost to get closer to him. Yeah, there's some damage. But I, I might be better off just using my missiles. Yeah, this is going to be good. Yeah, that's what you want. I wonder if it's possible to get him to, uh, like, to permanently close one of the mouths. If I take out whatever little crystal thing is in it. I am ruining this guy's day. This is something. I, do, I just might not want to use my super cannon at all. I might just want to do this. But this is the first fight where I actually have to... That's him. That's his core. This is the first fight where I actually have to, like... Think about how I'm moving and what I'm doing. That was 100% not worth it, but he didn't hit me. Now I got him. That was interesting. Probably better that guy is gone. That was intimidating. S. Yeah, I would love to get off this beach, so the sooner I finish these designated matches, the better. There is one more, but where? Or is it elevated? If it's elevated, then you know what? Good. That means I can get out of here. There doesn't appear to be a path here. I thought that's what I'm checking for, but I do not think I'm going to be satisfied. Okay, I can't walk around. Ah, nuts. No cheating. Ugh. The bike's up there now. Freaking Suda51 and his running trolls. He did that in No More Heroes 1 all the time. There was a miserable section in Flower, Sun, and Rain where that ended up happening. It's it's funny in retrospect, and it's kind of funny when you're doing it, but it's really annoying. But, okay, at least there is an out over here, so I'm assuming my designated fight's somewhere up there. I really hope it is. Mm. Huh. Alright, so he's not as cruel as he could have been, because this could have been worse. I'll hit up the, the WC and save and wrap it up. Let's do this, just for safety. Yeah, because I'm already going the wrong way. I was dazzled by the person's yellow shirt, but I think I saw the WC even from here. Yeah, we're good, we're good. And an ATM, and a sushi place.
Good, done, did it? I've activated him on my map. Oh, and the adventure. I think I'll save that for next time. 10,000 coins? That's like the easiest thing in the world. Yeah, I'll change into whatever this is. Can't really make it out, but... Alright, let's do the WC, and then I'll pick up on the visual novel after the fact. Here we go. Victory is mine. Cleanliness first. Hooray! I like that you could see one of the NPCs walking around in the background, implying that Travis really was just kind of holding that pose for a while. Alright, I did it. And now I will save. And now that we have unlocked more of this map, presumably, it is time to stop the installment. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? We beat Kimmy Power, who's something of a deep cut. I mean, I know she's from the previous numbered game, but that was on the Wii. It's been a while. And now we're out to weird CRT, wrecked building, dry beach, desert land. I don't know, but we're setting up for what may be the alien who blew up the city in the opening cutscene. Possibly, she's not available to meet with Fu, Damon isn't available, I don't know what's going on. Until next time, everyone.